I request, uh, maybe it is the right time to request uh, one participant from each country to, since uh, my chief executive and director Siktab is also here and Ravi sir and senior officers are here, to, from you we should know what exactly we did in this program, whether it was useful or what are the lacunas, so that we can improve it in the next time. So I may request one participant from each country. Uh, maybe two or three minutes, you can just say. Huh? Maybe we'll start. Anyone voluntary can come? Nepal first? Uh, Bangladesh first. OK, first, Bangladesh. Alphabetically, OK. <laughs> so Bangladesh first. Yes. OK, good, good afternoon. Respective all the directors, sir, and chief executive NECUI, sir, and all participants. At first, we would, we would like to thanks to the NCUI, NCUI authority to arrange this type of training program, and also thanks to my uh, sponsor, uh, sponsoring organization, my Bangladesh Cooperative um, Bank. Especially thanks to Mr. Ritesh sir, who helped us very much to getting visa. We are complete, <laughs> uh, and all kind of support. Thanks him for all kind of support. We are honored to be a part of this training program. We learned many things from this training. At first, we know. Uh, ethics. At first, correct yourself and you will manage the whole world. And we also uh, new things in this training learn. Um, a man having a mobile a man having a mobile number, he can get all type of banking service services without connecting internet. I think it is very helpful for rural people, rural farmer, and uh, it is improved in whole India. Also, uh, we knew many uh, another thing. S A S A G a small help group. It's a, a mechanism of Oman empowerment, I think. Already India it is established and, and it, uh, Oman empowerment are very powerful in India. Today, India is the large, largest cooperative movement in the whole world. India is, growing, India is growing very fast in cooperative sector. Hmm. We also grateful to Indian, gover Indian government and Indian people for their support uh, in, during our liberation war. We are very grateful, Indian nation. Uh, thanks to all for your all kinds of support and long live cooperative movements. Thank you. Uh, respected directors, uh, chief executive, and other uh, distinguished guests and participants, with uh, coming to end of our training tactics training for four days, I would say that to say that I have learn everything would be wrong, but I would definitely say it has lit the lamp that would go a long way in building my knowledge and capacity ahead. So I would like to uh, thank uh, SIGTAP and NCUI uh, and my management for uh, giving this opportunity. Uh, this opportunity uh, provided a forum uh, to gain knowledge and as well it was a uh, opportunity uh, for cultural exchange where five SARC nations participants are here where we could exchange our views and ideas and for me it was a new experience new experience in the sense new place uh, till date Taj Mahal for me was just in the pictures but uh, giving a field visit opportunity, uh, it has uh, really given me a new experience, such a beautiful monument in your country. Uh, I think uh, India, is a, uh, India is blessed to have such uh, beautiful monuments, and I really uh, thank for giving me opportunities. And one new experience was a new dish. Uh, it, has, it has really fattened me, and I think uh, when I go back, I will weigh ten more kgs more. <laughs> so, uh, really, really, thank you. It was a new experience, and uh, coming to uh, the topics uh, that that have been presented in four days, I would say that uh, it was very much relevant. Uh, in case of Bhutan, as I've uh, said earlier, we our cooperative scenario is not that much over India and Nepal, but. Uh, I think uh, we, we are initial stages, but we have self-help groups and small farmers group, uh, which would definitely, uh, in the coming days, uh, uh, go into a formation of cooperatives and all. And I would say that 
all the materials that have been presented here was very much relevant. And when we go back, I think we would very much try to implement and the ideas and knowledge that we have gained here would be very much put into a good use. So lastly, I would like to extend once more NCUI and SIGTEF for giving us these good opportunities and uh, we, we would definitely uh, make our management uh, realize and uh, know that uh, such a problem could be very much help to our uh, staffs and friends uh, out there at uh, Bhutan. Thank you very much. Respected guests uh, and my fellow participants, uh, I am Khem Kesi from, from Nepal and I would like to clear uh, one thing that uh, uh, I am nominated uh, from uh, NCVL. Actually, my organization is Metro Multipurpose Cooperative uh, in Pokhara in Nepal. Uh, uh, I would I would like to thank uh, Mr. Uh, my colleague Mr. Santos Kimire for nominating our organization and giving this platform to attend this kind of valued or valued training program. Uh, I would uh, chiefly I would like to thank NCUI and SIGTAP for such an amazing experience we have had during this training program. Especially thanks to Ritesh sir for warm reception and for his co comfortable gestures during our stay. Uh, I feel honored to meet. Uh, interact and share experiences with international participants and trainers from India, Sri Lanka, Bangladesh, and Bhutan. Uh, at this uh, time of wrapping up of this program, uh, I can assure our uh, organizers that you have achieved your objectives to change and improve in the field of cooperatives and rural financing. No doubt, we will implement our learnings, uh, learnings uh, in, our, in my country. Uh, I, would, I would also thank uh, Mr. Khursid and his team uh, for taking care of uh, taking care of us uh, during traveling to Agra, and uh, I and uh, I and my colleagues enjoyed the company of uh, uh, our international friends throughout our stay. Yeah, food was good, uh, and Delhi and Delhi is great. Thank you. Directors, chief executives, consultants on head of head table, dear friends from India, Bangladesh, <coughs> Nepal, Bhutan, and Sri Lanka. It gives me immense pleasure to speak a few words on behalf of our uh, Sri Lankan uh, friends. We came from Sri Lanka, 11 participants to gain knowledge and bring into our own country. Cooperative system in India very developed and helped the people, especially for farmers, very well. So that uh, many participants are coming to India to get thorough knowledge about the cooperative field. This training program, based on the topic training techniques for trainers of cooperatives and rural financing, institutions very very helpful to all of us the subjects were very useful to us to share the gaining knowledge to our cooperative workers in Sri Lanka our cooperative workers need more knowledge about the management administration finance and development strategies so that this program would definitely helpful to give a best result to deliver the training program more effective manner especially uh, we should uh, appreciate Dr. Nadeshan Nile's lecture is very attractive he discussed ethics and systematic approach to training and development and three main areas he discussed uh, self, teacher and output. And other lecturers also we should uh, mention here with our uh, sincere gratitude uh, 
Mr. Gupta, uh, uh, Dr. S uh, Singha, uh, K. N. Singha, Dr. Nitya Krishana, and others. We should uh, we should thanks all the lectures they gave their best to ours. Especially, we should thanks Mr. Rish Day helped us participate this program before we came to India. All the lectures also gave their fullest cooperation. Especially our uh, Indian friends, they gave their fullest support to us go to shop and uh, come again very safely. Thank you to all and again thank you to all the uh, organizers and uh, uh, your country to uh, best hospitality and uh, well organized this program. Thank you very much. It's my proud privilege to represent ourselves here with Siddharth and Vishal as a potential trainer of Central University of Haryana. In this international program on training techniques for cooperative trainers, we have learned a lot. All resource persons have given us countless information, informative information to us. And all the sessions were well planned. Well, we will definitely use all technical teaching techniques and information in our training programs. As we all know that cooperative learning is our pedagogical practice and for all trainers, they have to make themselves perfect in pedagogy and try to adapt KSC, knowledge, skill and attitude while planning the training learning objectives. We have learned training techniques from session of an ethic and systematic approach to training and development. All the training sessions like uh, training needs, analysis, design and uh, content of programs and training techniques and uh, methods were really beneficial for us. Now as a potential trainer, planning is, and implementation of training programs is very essential. We have to know that the TNA method, training needs analysis, and how we can implement KSE in our training techniques. And also, we should know how we can cover the steps of training ev uh, evaluations. We will definitely implement all the training techniques which we have learned here from our institutional positively. I would like to pay my hearty thanks to our honorable NCI chief executives, uh, Mr. N. Satyanarayan, Staff Director Dr. K. K. Tripathi ji, NCI Director Ved Prakash Sethia ji, and Executive Director NCI Dr. K. N. Sinha, and Director and Program Coordinator Mr. Ritesh Deji, and all the other members uh, who have given the support to us here, and for providing all the trainers for participating in this training program. Thank you very much to all of you. Jai Hind, Jai Bharat.